Then... Oh. oh, I'm gonna make myself some manulian. Uh, eventually. <laughs> I think I should be good for manualing. Gonna man it up. Goodness gracious. Alright. Take this device here. And this here. Uh. Dun dun dun. Even, did you hear about, um... They're coming out with a lot of graphene uses Gra graphene. recently. What's graphene? You've heard of graphene, haven't you? It's the, um... It's that carbon, like, diamond structure or whatnot that's, like... What they what they do is they they get this carbon atomic structure that's just a, a mesh that's an atomic... It's just one atom thick worth of carbon in a form that would go usually in diamonds. So it's just like a one atom thick layer of diamond, basically. Holy shit. Um, <clears throat> to a degree. So, I mean, it's a strong... It's super, super strong. It's stronger than carbon nanotubes, I believe. Um, and it's just a plane or whatnot. And ever since they've been getting more capable of working with it, they've just been coming out with idea after idea after thing after thing. Oh, wait, hold on. What? Oh uh, no 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 no! Primarily because I'm looking at the structure, not what's behind them. Oh. But uh, is you saying, Chris? Like it, it's really interesting how they're coming out with so many different uses for it and all that, you know. Yeah. And the thing is that it it hasn't been easily cre creatable for a long time, and it, it's still not very easy to create. But it's much easier now. Like they've come up with new ideas on how to do it because. It used to be the only way to make it, which is interesting because you could actually make it at home. If you took, like, um, your pencil lead mm -hmm. and you, uh, like, crushed it a bunch or whatnot, and you put it in tape, and you pushed the tape together and then pulled it apart, you would actually create a layer of the stuff or something like that. I don't remember the exact method. There's actually, there's, there's small quote-unquote tutorials out there, I guess, if you want <laughs> to look it up. Um, it's, of course, completely useless because I didn't know what you're going to do with it, <laughs> He may be making the strongest material in the universe, as far as we can tell, but you, there's no way you can use it, and it's stuck to your tape. So, but um, it's an interesting little thing. Uh, let's see, here. I needed a uh, export pipe, no, an import pipe. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. and so it's it's really cool, and it's got lots of uses. You can you know charge your phone Holy or car shit. while it's driving. Yeah, I was about to say a very important property of graphene is the unique electronic transport system that the resulting high electronic mobility. Electron. How fast or how through material materials semiconductable, <coughs> special interest because of their use in electronics. So yes, they can be used in, electrically speaking. Yeah, and then the other thing about them is they can actually store charge, so they can use them to make batteries. Um, I mean, they can take hydrogen, turn it into energy while you're apparently driving your car. Can you can time. use them as a battery. Speed and apparently, what? It can apparently, it apparently it speed. Yeah, apparently it beats silicon speed wise because of its low and conductivity. Yeah, yeah, low resistance. Um, what is it? Uh, which is in it, the negatives. <laughs> It can, um, th there's an interesting new thing, though, they're talking about, which is, um, 3D holographics. Or, oh, well, I don't know about 3D or not, but they say holographics, and I find that interesting. Um, because apparently they've done a, um, a, I think it might have been 3D, I'm not 100% sure, because this is, like, an atomic thick, I don't quite know how they're doing it. They might just have, like, curtains of it as a medium. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. You know, and they're just projecting light into it, which is fine, I guess. I'm just, you know, it's not quite to the same degree, but it is 3D capable. Um, but it's 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 on a small scale right now. It's like only been like, I think it was a few meters, like a, like a centimeter by a centimeter or something like that, cubic, probably. 
but I find it interesting that they're actually using it for 3D applications, and it'd be cool to see that as 3D. Like, originally, yeah. when I was hey, thinking well, about hold it... The, hold the fuck up, Chris. Yes. Okay, I'm sorry. I just had to miraculously look in the beauty of this, and... He... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was just like you. I was being overstimulated. I was just like, look <laughs> at this beauty, and my eyes were like, go, like trembling with rainbows. And you're like, blasting my eardrums. I'm like, what the fuck is he talking about anymore? <laughs> <laughs> sorry. So as you were saying, <laughs> like, what is it? Um, what's really cool about it is that you you can see 3D without glasses. You know, Holy shit. but as well as that, um. What it, it uh see now when I was looking at it, uh, they said you could see it without glasses and you'd see 3D and it'd be holographic. And I was thinking to myself, okay, this is going to be like 3D level. This is just going to be like a panel with slightly raised edges. I was assuming. Uh-huh. You know how like you take the picture thing and you tilt it left yeah, and right, yeah, I know that and it bullshit. changes. I was imagining something similar to that, but it just uses depths to th- to make a 3D picture. Uh-huh. And then you just visually take it in as 3D, much like the 3DS, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but that apparently wasn't it. They're actually just, they're actually, I, I'm assuming, putting down like a curtain in a cube shape and putting projected light into it, hmm. which is quite interesting. I also found it interesting when they were talking about it because they, they mentioned some scientific terms and stuff almost, like they like they had to cool it with laser beams and stuff. Because if you don't cool it, the the light's slightly off due to it refracting differently due to heat, you know, and stuff like that. And it's just like mm-hmm. hell. <laughs> because I mean, it was just a sentence, and like every other word was a word that was so complex that you'd really have to know what the hell they're talking about to get into it. And if you read it once, you wouldn't get Wait, it. What? You'd have to break it down. Well, what the fuck is this? Uh, oh, he's dead. <laughs> Ooh, what is that? I was about to ask, have you ever, <coughs> have you, I came across, alright, this is a YouTube channel, Red Hot mm-hmm. Nickel Ball. Yeah, I've seen that. <laughs> yeah, well, he used it on uh, Aerogel. Do you know what Aerogel is? Uh, Yeah, I know what Aerogel is. It, I think I see the one you're talking about. There's another type of Aerogel what someone was showing off. Um, What it is, it looks slightly blue because it's ref- reflecting, um, light in a certain way through air mm-hmm. because it's blue through air um but this thing this structure is really really light mm-hmm. and it's, it's structured off of i can't really remember it quite well but it's it's like equivalent of a really really fine wafer and it's just like stacked on top of each other yeah. so it's like it's really nice cylinder that's full of 98 percent air in other words like frozen and it's smoke. just like it's crazy it's well it's yeah. also nicknamed that um and i think it's used for cushioning to some degree in some place i don't quite remember yes but it has an extremely high heat tolerance yeah as it's mostly air yeah but uh i like how i type in graphene right yeah and then there's Graphene aerogel, and I was like, holy shit, I was about to just talk to you about that. <laughs> and that's what's holding these extremely, like, large rocks over delicate flowers. <laughs> it's really fucking amazing. And it makes you wonder, what is it protecting? The flower or the rock? <laughs> <laughs> and you just see the rock on there, and he's just like, oh! <laughs> <laughs> I want to touch it. I want to touch Aerogel. I want to chew on it. <laughs> <laughs> it must dissolve in your mouth. Um, <laughs> no, it just dissolves in your lungs. <laughs> <laughs> and you just die. Alright, I can't use this genetic... Mm, machine thingamabob that's the advanced one that's in this other chest. But I have used the inoculator and I it worked. Oh crap, this thing's full. What is it full of? Oh, redstone's being taken care of. Honeydew's kind of high. Well, I look forward to the field museum with its beautiful, beautiful, delicate that's one reason, the only reason why we're going this way, well, one of the 
Okay, scratch it. We'll go in there. Check out the uh, Rock Geode collection. Because eh? Alexis is like shit crazy about geodes and all that. Yeah, they're pretty cool. She, she's, she, in other words, she likes to die over Minecraft if she played it. <laughs> <laughs> What's taking up so much space right now? Because she's like, here's a beautiful ammo. Here's a beautiful metalloid. Here's a beautiful XYZ. And then fucking wants to make something with it. And I'm like, just fucking play my track. <laughs> What's taking up so much space in here? Oh, uh, it might be might be a few different items, actually. Um, And also the humanitarian portion of it. Because I want to see... I want to see the Egyptian stuff, or whatever else is there. But we are spending an entire day at the art museum, though. So the second day when we leave is going to be completely dedicated to the art museum. Mm -hmm. Well, of course, any other activities are outside of that, but it's just the museum for the bulk of it. Because that's one reason why we're going. That's the main reason why we're going. Alright, um... That's probably Watch part it. of the reason, actually, now that I think about it, is it's trashing a few other items. Hey, Alex, can you send me the spreadsheet? Alright. All this trash. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Just send me the spreadsheet. I'm not gonna. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully that works out. I um, hate spreadsheets. Spreadsheets, Chris. I like it. I like it. I, what? <laughs> I, I, I um. Take your wife. I've got a. I've got a calendar I made in Excel. Yeah. And it's beautiful. I know it. They're beautiful, but fucking, they're such a pain in the ass. It's not that bad if you know what you're doing. Yeah, after What's you know doing? what you're doing. It, before then, you're like, the fuck am I doing? <laughs> no, it's, it's pretty easy. It's pretty easy. It, it depends on what you're doing. You were working with a budget, though, right? And that's what you're doing? Oh, yeah. I was just doing a budget. Yeah, that's But then it brought, back, it brought back horrible... It brought back horrible memories. When I was doing fucking multiple layers, you, you, you know when you push T... On MMOs and you get your character window. Yeah. I was doing fucking formulas for that. <laughs> that. That if you entered in a single variable, it would change everything. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be, you gotta make I, sure you know what you're doing with it or else you end up in a massive hole. No, no, no. I'm not saying, I'm not saying it was ineffective. It was super effective. Oh, no, I know it's effective. It's just that if you're not watching what affects the numbers. Oh, no, it's not. Yeah. For one, that. And two, it was just the fact that I made it really, really, really... Hard to understand? Not hard to understand. I dedicated so much time to it. Show it to Alex. It's not damn funny. Because <laughs> I was... It was turned, I think, like two years ago when I was going hog wild over Mabinogi. Hmm. Lead, gold. I think I need gold. Um, but, lapis. Fucking. Uh, okay. Next submit. I need so many ores. Alright, that's pretty good. Um, hopefully a lot of redstone ore comes through that device, because I need a crap ton of redstone, and redstone ore from the nether is worth a lot. Um, or use, rather. Okay, yeah, so... Yeah, one ore equals 24, so I mean, that's totally worth it. So, it, it, it's going to be 20, 20, 20, 21 dollars, round check, mm -hmm. for the train. Because I don't think everyone wants... Wait, what? For the round check for the train, 21. 
Oh, 21 for the train. Okay. I was yeah, like, okay. 21 to go to Chicago and back? Man, we are saving. <laughs> what kind of numbers? I mean, it was like we lived there off of, t- off of a dollar. <laughs> There'd have been no way. Why is this not... Wait. Why is it suddenly stopped? The hell? Um, I don't know. I don't know why this is doing this. It should be working automatically, but whatever. I don't think it knows how to deal with all of the resources it's creating. That's glowstone. Sorry. So what were you saying about fucking Survivor not for a dollar a day? <laughs> I, was, I was just thinking, I'm like, $21 to go to Chicago and back it, and like, it, you made it sound almost for a moment like like we went to Chicago and somehow lived off of $1 while we were out there. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how the fuck we made that happen. I don't remember Jack I don't shit. think anyone knows how to make that happen. <laughs> I only remember calling in. I only remember calling in to pay... What did you say? Parking toll? Yes. From 45 miles away. <laughs> and the number lol. <laughs> and the number lol. We were just like, we gotta pay our, we gotta pay our parking spot lol. <laughs> uh, uh, That's how you do it. Good thing is, Link, at least Lincoln Park Zoo is free. Admission free. That's at least one fucking good thing about the place. But unfortunately, it is on the north side. Not hardcore on the north side, but it's you know it's fucking it's a trip. Enough for us to fear for our lives. Enough for me to fucking be annoyed. <laughs> That's all it takes. Ah. Uh. The Art Institute. It's like twenty. I think it was just twenty dollars. Oh, wait, no, it's $20 for Illinois residents. It's 23 if you don't have an ID. Whole episodes be aired on there. I don't know, maybe because they make their money off of their own site and <laughs> it being illegally uploaded. Uh, the Field Museum is 25 Oh, shit. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to watch this. Okay. Sure. Well, it's, it's 25 for the Field Museum, but that's because we're doing, we're keeping it down to the basic, basic expeditions. It was, it, it's, it's 25 normal, right? To, for the normal permanent expeditions. Exhibit, mm-hmm. yeah, ex, hit, expeditions. The temporary expeditions, such as, see this dinosaur and how it used to live, is like three, no, yeah, it's five additional dollars, so it goes from from 25 to 30 for additional mm-hmm. expeditions and personally I just want to see the human you know, the, fucking what are the expeditions that they have going on there they're really they're really meh like the permanent expeditions involve the the geodes and yeah it involved Granger Hall of Gems the DNA Discover Center. So wait, are we? Well, I'm sure they have a gift place for the geodes and stuff. Yes, they do. Because I want, I would like to get one, but I, I never had any money that I could just use. But now that you know, I could talk to Dad about it, and just figure it out. It's well worth it. I'd like, like to get it. We have, we have cut. I mean, I think we have one upstairs. I just, I'd like to have my own. I could just put it in my room, you know. Yeah. And then, of course, you got... So, we're going to find, like, a meteorite size, and I'm just going to set it on top of my desk. <laughs> <laughs> the one problem with the ticket expeditions is, like, Titans of Ice Age, which is just mammoths. Uh, the Sacred Powers mm-hmm. of Haiti, which 
I don't. That really does look fucked up. I'm not. I don't. I mean, I haven't studied anything of that, so I'm not gonna touch it. Who sends their fucking twin daughters to two separate schools after secondary education? So I'm guessing high school. After secondary. It says after secondary. After sec- secondary. Secondary considered high school. After se- in our system? Yes. High school is secondary. Oh, uh, you fuck overseas. I was talking about America. Yeah, yeah fuck yeah. America. <laughs> yeah. Why do they have to count last names? Vikings. What? I, I don't fucking know, Alexa. What about last names? Uh, about actors. What about them? I don't know. Something about stupid actors. Yeah, I don't really care about Vikings. I mean, I myself have a personal... Eh, they do look good. Fuck you, hist. <laughs> it's like, yeah, fuck. No. What? No, Evan. No. Wait what, you think Vikings are cool? Yeah, I think Vikings are cool. I think they're interesting. I, I, I've been watching Not randomly. Not so badasses, I just said cool. <laughs> I just, I oh. have like... I have like, uh... I've recently had oh. PewDiePie on the right side of my screen for a little while, right? Uh-huh. And oh. he's he's been talking about how he, he every once in a while he's mentioned something about like Vikings and how he's connected to it because oh. I think it's like in his blood because you know they they were in uh, Sweden at some point I'm sure yes and it's just like I think to myself I'm not sure if he should should be thinking in any sort of praiseful way about them or not you know because it, it's one of those difficult things it's like it's like the Huns and whatnot they went around they killed raped and pillaged. Wait. They're not but like the Mongols. Like, do, you, do you respect so that or not? You know. Her as the twin sister that... Maybe because she has bad acting skills. No, but she's been an actress in other shows and other things along with her sister. I don't know. Maybe because of like, I don't know. I was about but to say so acting she's, rights she's and casted in the show much, right? like this. This couples well, out there who her actually twin sister in the show looks very similar to her. The the actress looks similar, to her, but not the exact same. So I just assume you know they made fraternal. Maybe they're actually twins. They just, you know, don't look like as you'd like to. But then I was reading that she does actually have a twin in her life. And it's not that actress. So why the fuck didn't they cast the fucking twin she actually had? I don't know, maybe because the twin was like, fuck that. I don't know. They could have easily just had her be blonde or wear a wig. If that's what they seriously wanted. Well, they couldn't make her hair blonde, huh? I don't fucking know, they're actors. They were fucking, they, they, yes, they're twins. Maybe because they didn't want to be like the Ashley twins or some shit. They were like, we're individuals. <laughs> I don't fucking know. So, okay, now I remember why I made... Okay, so, Nat... Na- <clears throat> basic admission to the Field Museums, a- 20 bucks, right? Yeah. For five additional dollars, you're able to get one ticket to any additional expedition. I didn't I don't fucking understand that. I chose that because in case if you come across, you want to see Galapagos Islands, go see Galapagos Islands. I don't fucking care. But, you know, each individual, each party member did that. And the one problem is freaking, I don't understand why it's 30, why, why is it an additional $11 from basic of 20? It goes from 18, 25, 31. And you're able to ex- experience it all, and I'm like, hey, fuck that. Who knows? And then, let's see. I, I've yet to grab any information about boat rides. Uh, apparently, I've got to make some frames. I'm not too into frames. I don't know why, but I keep looking over to my mic and I question it from time to time because it's just like, Ever so slightly odd. It angers me. <laughs> I'm like, I just want you to sit at a specific point, raise up and down in this, in, in, whenever it's reasonable. But it's just like out of scope sometimes. Alright, so you get an untreated. It's probably going to eat it because it's annoying. Yep, it's gone. Right yeah, I need to treat sticks first. D 
details, details. And the soul frame, that's probably not nice at all. Actually, oh sweet. It's actually pretty nice. Okay, I can fiddle with getting pregnant, or I can just say screw it. Because I've got plenty of seeds, which reminds me, actually, I need to, um... Also, with, you know how, you know, at first, they say you have, the internet gives you access to a lot of information, right? And they're like, mm-hmm. if you, back in the day when I was growing up, if you needed information on, like, the farmer's guide, you had to either go to the store and buy one. Or, or become not, a farmer. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, and now you can just download it immediately. But in my book, technology is when I have to tra- plan a trip and I need to know, <laughs> need to know the tolls. <laughs> 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 and, and I could do that real quickly. <laughs> Back in the days, toll systems probably worked a whole lot better because people wouldn't avoid them. <laughs> it's a British fucking problem. It's a Brit- fucking British. Fucking skins. We used to be British one day. Actually, well, no, I guess on my mom's side, it would have been British. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> Hold the fuck up. Ah, Actually, I suppose... What? Who knows how that works. I don't fucking know. What movie is that? Oh, you mean that? Who the fuck has that as a bed sheet? Alexis, I don't... Alexis! I'm still... I'm still... <laughs> recording. I don't want to look. Need what do I need? I need seeds. Yeah, doing so many things. Come here. Come here. Uh, uh, I went to the bank today, and I told the woman to set up the bill to be auto paid. And yeah. I think she. I have two loans, and I think she. I think she. I think she. I think she used her hog one. I think so. I think she chose the car loan and not the consumer loan. <laughs> Lettuce. Why you be? No, don't. Yeah, I think she chose the wrong loan. Freaking lettuce. So I have to go down there. Hopefully not again on the third. No, fuck it. I'll just have you call. And see if they actually follow out the transactions. Because like, freaking we're too busy talking to the woman. That I think she was just like, yeah, 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 yeah. Come make this loan. Okay, I don't pay. And I'm like, stop. That's fine. You know, both loans are just. Fucking the guy, Alexis. You know, like. Really like, both loans are the exact same amount. Besides, like five, wait, no, not even five dollars, two dollars and fifty cents. Wait, no, two dollars and twenty-five cents. It's literally. And now I'm serious, I'm gonna back. Oh my fucking god, Alexis! <laughs> so it's just like uh, I don't know far. which one it was because I wasn't too sure on the price because I knew you, you know, with with bills you usually round up. <laughs> it's like fifty-seven eighty-nine. Okay, so it's fifty-eight. It's nineteen ninety-nine. Well, I guess it's twenty dollars. What the fuck do you want? Fucking hell! Uh, get these seeds going. Oh dear. 293. 293. 2. 9. 3. Enter. Bang. Alright, I'm gonna call technicality on this because it's just mixing it with seed oil. I don't feel like crushing seeds for this. Okay. So. Uh. I shall send you a bill form. What the fuck is that? What is what is this? What is this inbound malicious shit from Skype? Oh, <laughs> the hell! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
that's why. I'll save this. Because <laughs> I, I pushed save. I pushed control save, and then the malicious thing popped up. Uh. And it just yelled at you. Yeah, and I was just like... Oh, oh. <laughs> it's weird as shit. 